Welcome viewers, in this video we will see the solved problem based on the substitution theorem. Subscribe the channel for more videos and notification. Soft copy of this material available in the drive, the link is given in the description box. Now we will go to the topic, solved problem for substitution theorem. For the network shown below, substitute the branch AB by voltage source or current source. We know that substitution theorem means the any branch can be replaced by the some other branch by maintaining voltage and current. We can replace with other, other elements, but we should maintain the current and voltage. For example, consider this the network. The 12 voltage source is available. 1, 2, 3, 4 resistors are available. 2 ohm, 2 ohm, 4 ohm and 2 ohm. Here we are going to substitute. It is uh, termed as the terminal AB. So we need to replace this net this terminal this branch by a voltage source and current source provided the current flowing through this branch ab and voltage across this branch ab should be maintained so we need to find what is the current flowing through ab what is the potential across ab accordingly we can replace with voltage source and current source the original current and voltage should be maintained across ab thereby we can replace by voltage source and current source. So, first we will find the what is the current and voltage available across AB, right. So, in order to find the current, we need to simplify this resistor. So, from this diagram, it is clear that these two are connected in series. This 2 ohm and 2 ohm are connected in series. That is parallel with this 4 ohm and that is connected in series with this 2 ohm, right. So, this 2 ohm and 2 ohm are connected in series in parallel with 4 ohm. First we will simplify this network. So 2 plus 2 4 that 4 ohm is connected in parallel with this 4 ohm. So the equivalent resistance is R1 into R2 divided by R1 plus R2 that is R1 is 4 ohm. R2 also 2 plus 2 4 ohm. 4 into 4 divided by 4 plus 4 16 divided by 8 2 ohm right. So this branch is 2 ohm that is connected in series with is another 2 ohm. This resultant 2 ohm is connected in series with the 2 ohm. So, the final resistor is 2 plus 2, 4 ohm, right. The total resistance of this network is 4 ohm. So, from that we can find the total current, current I, total current IT equal to V by R. V is nothing but 12 voltage, R is nothing but 4 voltage. So, 12 by 4 is 3 ampere. So, current flowing, the total current available in the circuit is 3 ampere, not a branch AB. The total current available in the entire network with the voltage source 12 voltage is 3 ampere. So, IT equal to 3 ampere. Similarly, we need to find what is the voltage across AB. So, voltage across AB, V equal to I into R. R is 2 ohm. What is the current? We need to find what is the current flowing through AB. Right. So, the total current is 3 ampere. The three total current available is 3 ampere. So, from this voltage source 3 ampere is flowing. At this point, the current is diverted. The current is diverted. See, this, this is 4 ohm. This is also 4 ohm. Both are equal resistor. So, 3 ampere will be equally divided. 1.5 ampere and 1.5 ampere. If it is different value, we can go with the current division rule. But here the resistor values are equal 4 ohm and 2 plus 2 4 ohm so the equal amount of current will be divided so iab is nothing but 3 divided by 2 1.5 ampere so vab equal to v equal to i into r i is 1.5 ampere the resistor is 2 amp 2 ohm so 3 voltage right so the current through the branch ab is 1.5 ampere voltage across ab is 3 voltage so, by maintaining these two values, current and voltage, we can replace with either current source or voltage source. That is the question given. Right? Now, we are going to replace the branch AB with voltage source then by current source by maintaining these two values, 1.5 ampere and 3 voltage. Right? Now, we will see how to replace. How to replace the value. By substitution theorem, the branch AB may be substituted either by independent voltage source of value 3 voltage. That is our requirement with a branch current of 1.5 ampere. 
if you replace with the voltage source the voltage value will be 3 voltage and the current will is current flowing through the network is 1.5 ampere or by independent current source with the value of 1.5 ampere with the branch resistance branch the voltage is 3 voltage right so either we can replace with voltage source with 3 voltage and 1.5 ampere or current source with 1.5 ampere with 3 voltage right so these two possibilities we will check with this so the these two cases can shown below so this is the original network ab initially we have 2 ohm resistor now replaced with voltage source here another possibility we can replace with current source right what is the current value 1.5 ampere the voltage drop across should be 3 voltage here voltage source what is the voltage source value 3 voltage the current flowing through should be 1.5 ampere right so modified network with branch ab replaced by the voltage source modified network with branch ab replaced by current source right so by maintaining current and voltage we replace the voltage source one possibility current source another possibility so in this problem we discuss the substitution theorem the given network in this the branch ab is replaced by voltage source and current source before that we need to find what is the voltage across ab what is the current flowing through ab by using that value there the branch is replaced by the current source and voltage source with maintaining the required value of current and voltage subscribe the channel for more videos and notification soft copy of this material available in the drive the link is given in the description box thank you for listening